NBC gets paid on time, we get paid on time, the mayor gets paid on time, y'all should get paid on time. And I really think it's, it's, we're long overdue in addressing how important it is. Because if we're expecting people to want to live and work here, if we want to incentivize everyone to spend their money here, it would be nice to get paid on time so that you can afford to live here, so that you can afford to spend money if that is this administration's priority. So I stand in solidarity with you all and true admiration because what you are doing while we have to be here is admirable. I'm embarrassed. I do apologize that we can't get it together. I have a baker in my district with the I don't know if you're here, who has been doing the work for over 40 years. And these are all women, all immigrant women, who are raising our communities. And I think it's important to highlight that in gentrifying communities where people have real, real estate have taken over and we've said, you know, Williamsburg is not old Williamsburg. Los Sures is still in the house. Bushwick is still Bushwick. Our communities are still what they were 10, 20 years ago. And we cannot turn our backs on those communities because right. we think it looks different, because we've real estate, because we've incentivized real estate in a different way. These are communities that need the most attention. These are the people that are holding on to the fabric of our communities and they deserve to get paid on time. We need to figure it out. I want to applaud Chair Joseph for hosting today's hearing. All right. yeah.